Welcome to Darling Games. We are going to play part three of Animal Crossing on our new island. So today is Monday, October 3rd. Let's see what Tom Nook has to say. Hello everyone, this is Tom Nook. It's 8.50 a.m. this Monday, October 3rd, 2022. Now for today's news. Some stunning news just in. We're moving forward with construction of Daisy Museum. Neither Blathers nor I imagine we'd get ready to build a museum on this very first day on the island. We're very grateful for everyone's cooperation. Anywho, we've started construction for the museum at the very spot where Blathers had his tent. So sorry to inconvenience you all that like this today. Tis a shame to suspend our scientific endeavors. However, I hope having our splendid new museum completed by tomorrow will make up for this little setback. That was a little message from Blathers. Ask me to pass on to all of you. Also, my staff Timmy and Tommy opened up their shop today. It's a small shop, but they'll change stock daily and carry a selection of goods sure to better your island life. Come by from 8 to 10 daily, and if the store is closed, simply use their drop box to sell your items. Ah, uh, one more thing. To celebrate the opening of the shop, we've added a new catalog service to the Nook Shopping. The catalog lets customers see a record Record of items they've obtained of purchase or purchase. Any mass marketed items can be ordered directly through the catalog, so make good use of it. Now then, with all that said, I hope everyone takes advantage of the new Nook's cranny. By the way, whenever we cover big island developments like this, we'll hold a special commemorative ceremony afterwards. We'd like as many folks as possible to take part, so stop by resident services if you're interested. Oh dear, never fails. Of course this would happen right in the middle of a broadcast. Uh, ha, one moment please. Hello, this is Tom Nook from Nook Inc. Yes. What? A getaway package? Why, yes. Yes. Of course. And that's all for today. Island-wide broadcast. Uh, so sorry to put you on hold. Allow me to give you a full overview of the... Well, that was exciting. Sounds like we might be getting some new residents. Let's check our mailbox. Daisy May sent us, I'll be handling... I'll be heading to your island every Sunday morning to sell my precious turnips, just the way my grandma used to. Okay. Go ahead and delete that. Oops. We got a small mushroom platform and another small mushroom platform and then a hand cart. Let's see what Gulliver gave us. Here's a little gift to thank you for all your help. I'm supposed to be steering the ship right now, but I had to write this before I forgot. Anyway, I see a big rock up ahead, so I'd better wrap this up. Bye. Love, Gulliver. Let's see what Gulliver gave us. A sphinx. I don't think I've ever gotten that one before. We'll take it. So I was thinking we would put our small mushroom platform right here by this large one. Perfect. Put one there, and then let's put one right over here on this other side. All right, there's our new little mushroom entranceway. That's all we have right now, so that's what we're going to use. But I think that looks kind of cute right now. We are going to go talk to Tom Nook. Let's see what Tom Nook has to tell us today, because I have a feeling that there's some things that we need to learn from him. Yes, of course. Don't worry about a thing. We can set up your getaway package to include a lovely furnished home. Mm-hmm. Oh, not at all. We'll set up your move-in date at a later time. No, no, no trouble at all. I just need to draw up the proper contracts. Understood. We will get back to you very soon. Thank you. Darling, sorry to keep you waiting. I suppose you overheard that call I just got. For some time now, I've been advertising the Daisy getaway package. And wouldn't you know, out of the blue, we have three interested parties. That's great. Yes, yes. It's quite wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Er, wonderful except for one minor little detail. None of our applicants are too fond of the notion of sleeping in tents, you see. I'm afraid I got caught up in the excitement of persuading them to move here, and I may have promised them fully furnished homes. Free homes setting alongside the land, preparing all the furnishing. It's just too much for one raccoon. But darling, here you are, in my hour of need. It most certainly must be fate. Would you help me with get these homes prepared? All three of them? Of course, I will have to give you a good and proper thank you for your assistance. Of course. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'll never forget this. Oh, you're going to need some top secret instructions. When you're ready, come talk to me. Use the phrase, what should I do? Agent Nook out. Oh, this is fun. Well, I would like Tom to forgive my loan. That's what I'd like him to do, but I highly doubt he's going to do that. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. What should I do? Oh, so you're already ready to help me prepare. Here's what I'm thinking. We really should start building a bridge across a river somewhere. With three homes to build, I worry that we'll run out of space on land that isn't as easily accessible. A bridge will open things up a bit and make it easier to get to housing plots during construction. Hmm? So that's why I'd like you to start by crafting the parts for a bridge base. Get your DIY skills ready and then you'll want to decide on a prime location for the bridge too. And done. I've just sent you a recipe for a bridge construction kit. You can find it on your Nook phone. Once you've assembled your bridge construction kit, 
Connecticut, find a good spot for a bridge and then check with me. It can be a little tricky to place a bridge, but we can talk if you have trouble or need some advice. Good luck, darling. Let's also talk to him about having a ceremony. Let's hold a ceremony. Oh, you want to take part in a ceremony, darling? Right now, we'd like to celebrate the completion of Nook's Cranny. Interested? I sure am. Splendid. Let's get started. Oh, look how cute they look. They're all so cute. Now then, welcome to our dedication ceremony honoring Daisy's brand new Nook's Cranny. Thank you. Daisy truly started out as a deserted island. There simply wasn't much here, but now it's slowly beginning to develop thanks to the tireless efforts of, well, everyone, really. I'd like to ask Timmy and Tommy to say a few words as representatives of the new Nook's Cranny. Timmy, Tommy, if you would, please. Thank you, Daisy. Because of you, we've opened a proper shop. My brother and I will work hard to make it the best shop, and I hope we can count on your business. Yes, yes, thank you both. Next, a few words from someone who made many valuable contributions toward seeing Nook's Cranny built. Yes, yes, Daisy's very own darling. Floor is yours, darling. Anything to add? Good for us. Yes, yes, indeed. Thank you for your heartfelt and encouraging sentiments there, darling. Everyone, please get ready to join me in bringing this ceremony to a close. Also, those wishing to take a commemorative photo should get ready to press the square circle button. Yes, well then, with hope for our continued growth and to celebrate Daisy's beautiful nook's cranny. Hooray! Thank you all. This concludes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. Well, that is done. So now we need to build a brick. Let's check our DIY recipes. The bridge needs four log stakes, some clay, and some stone. So we have everything but the log stakes. What do we need for log stakes? Oh, we have stuff to make that. So let's take care of that right now. We made the log stakes, so now we can do the bridge construction kit. So let's go ahead and craft that. Let's check our ABD while we're in here. Welcome to Nook Shop, a multimedia terminal for Nook Inc. Once per day, we got a bonus of 100 miles. Excellent. Let's see what's in the Nook shopping. Special goods. We got a garden faucet. Let's see. Not too much that I'm really overly interested in. We got all this really cute Mario stuff here. I mean, we could probably get another large mushroom and two more small mushrooms to put somewhere else on our island. The other thing I was thinking is how about we get two pipes? So we finished that. I do like to order everything. Like I would like to order at least the five items if possible, if I have the money at the very beginning. Oops, I didn't mean to go into there. Because if you order the items at the very beginning, then you don't have to, or then you get the um, the Nook Shopping app on your phone a lot quicker. Let's check over here. Cardboard box and a rusted part. We're just gonna leave those. Let's go find a spot to place the bridge. I was kind of thinking back towards the back here, we could place the bridge. Or maybe we should just place it. You know, I notoriously will just go right here to, let's look at our, let's look at our map. Because I usually just go right to the edges, like where the beach is which is really convenient when you're just trying to run around collecting like shells and things. Very convenient to have it over there. So I would say probably just either right here or on the other side. Let's do the other side since that's where we can get our pier. Let's see if the bridge kit will work right here. Oh, it does. Perfect. Should I reserve the spot? Yes. Good. Now we can get over to our pier. I picked a spot for the bridge. Let the land connect. So it is kind of close to our beach right here. That's a really convenient spot to put a bridge. Let's go around the beach and collect all of our shells and find our DIY. We found our DIY right here in front of the museum. Let's see what DIY we get this time. Honeycomb wall. Hmm. Well, at least with the honeycomb wall, it's a use for our wasps nests so that we can make some money. Let's go ahead and drop the fossil back down and place the ant again because I had to pick up the ant in order to get it. So we've got to place this ant right back down. That way we don't forget to donate it tomorrow to Blathers. Now that we've collected all our shells, let's go around the island and find, let's shake the trees. Let's find all all the fossils. It looks like we've got a money tree right here. So let's go ahead and take care of that. I forgot to check how much money I had. Oops, I might not have 10,000 bells. I do not. Let's deposit this. Uh, put away. So we'll do 8,000 bells. Oh, you know what? If we just go around and do our rocks, let's leave the money hole open, the tree open for a minute. And let's go around, shake some trees. And let's see if we can find enough money to get up to the 10,000. Oh, you know what? I'm shaking these trees. I forgot these are all my fruit trees, so they're not going to have any money in them. I need to go to the trees on the regular spot. We need
need to check on our pumpkins. We probably need to water them, right? So that we can get three pumpkins when they grow. So let's spend a little bit of time watering our pumpkins. I'm super glad that we upgraded the water can so that we can get more pumpkins at a time now. Find that if I stand right on one of them, I get the three in front and I get the three that are right next to where I'm standing. Key though is to go slow because if you go too fast like I just did, then you get past it and then you don't water as much and then your can's gonna break. Look at that, our pumpkin patch is all sparkly and shiny. So we should be getting some extra pumpkins after that. Oh, we got an item. What did we get? We got a toolbox. Let's see what the toolbox looks like. Oh, we got a red toolbox. You know what? Let's go place this item that we just bought, um, the wheelbarrow. Let's go place the wheelbarrow over here with our pumpkin pack. Yeah, we'll place that there. And then maybe we can place a couple of these. Well, actually, we only have one set of log sticks. We'll just place, place one set of log sticks over here too. Look at our mums, you guys. Let's water these and let's see if we can get them to change colors. Let's see if we can get some other color flowers by watering these. Wouldn't it be cool if we could get some like pink ones or purple or green? I love all the mums. I think the mums, well, I would say the mums are probably my second favorite flower. When you get the different hybrids, the cosmos are actually my favorite and that's what my island flower is. So I'm super excited about that. We're also going to go ahead and water these white roses, even though I know we don't have another color rose, just because white next to white can give us different colors. We'll just water them anyway. Of course, they're not touching so we probably won't get any other colors but I don't want to change it because I want to get some red roses and some yellow roses to try and get other colors too. We need to remember to check the shop for that today. Early game for me is just a lot about picking up sticks and um, just kind of like making sure you get all the stuff out of your rocks. So I always dig the holes early game just to make sure that I'm getting everything out of the rocks because you just don't want to let anything go to waste because you just have no money. So everything is super valuable in the very beginning and um, um, yeah, it's just it's it's just a lot of little tasks farming and fishing and that kind of stuff Let's see if we can catch this bug because I don't think we have this bug yet I think it's called a tiger beetle. Maybe yes, we got a tiger beetle. Oh, we found our money rock Yay, so now we should have enough money to be able to fill the money tree Hey, and we fully got all of the money good deal Yeah, it's always really a good thing to get all the money out of the money rocks Let's just head right on over there and do our tree while we're thinking about it. We'll grab this fossil on the way. Nope, there went our shovel. Let's go grab the tree. We're gonna grab 10,000 bells. Then let's plant it for a money tree. Awesome. We got our money tree for the day. Let's continue going around and shaking all the trees and getting all that stuff. We got some new stuff for blathers. So let's go ahead and just put it down over here. That way we remember tomorrow to give it to him. Now that we're done shaking the trees, let's go talk to Tom Nook about, um, not these guys. Let's go talk to Tom Nook about the bridge we already placed. Ah, darling. Hello, hello. So, did you find a good place to deploy your bridge construction kit? I set it up. Splendid, excellent work, thank you. Then tomorrow we'll have a new bridge up and it'll it'll be even easier to get around the island. Now that that's out of the way, it's time to start on some homes. We can wait for the bridge construction to finish if you want, or just ask me what should I do whenever. Hmm? Let's ask him what should we do. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. What should I do? Darling, the bridge won't be ready till tomorrow, but you want to start on homes now? Please, take these three housing kits. With the housing kits I just gave you, you'll pick out three homes. Then, of course, these homes will need furniture and such. Each housing kit comes with a list of furniture it requires for the house. So be sure to read those lists. You can build everything DIY style. So just, so let me just send you the recipes you'll need. I think that's all for me. Thanks for all your help. Why don't we check and see what Nook Miles we have. We also need to make sure what Nook Mile Plus we need to do. Oh, we have to stretch today, catch some bugs, fish. We already did the hitting rocks. And it looks like we need to sell a hot item for a fortune. Ooh, and we can sell some shells. All right, so we will need to do all that kind of stuff. Let's just check and see what else we've got here. Let's talk to our villager. Let's talk to Flip. Ugh, I can't catch anything. Check me out. I'm gonna catch the biggest, baddest fish on the island. Rewrap. Okie dokie. Go over to this space and see if there's a place for one of these plots. Maybe even a couple of them. Like, what about like right here? Looks like one of the housing kits can fit right here, so let's put it here. There's our first kit. Plot number one is placed. My phone is ringing. Hello? That you, darling? Yes, yes, this is Tom Nook. How goes your search for housing land? I've got some ideas. Stupendous. I'm relieved to hear 
that everything is going according to plan. Be sure to check the box in front of the plot or each home. It'll show you the items required for that plot. Interior items should be placed in the box while exterior items should be placed outside and around the plot. We want to make it look nice and decorative now. Hmm? Once you've set up plots for all three homes and placed the regular items, come report back to me. I'll be waiting in resident services. Thanks again for your help. Ooh, we have a ladder recipe. We need to go make a ladder. Now that we have a ladder, we can get this present that we dropped the other day. Let's see what's in this present. A retro radiator. So that we have to place on a wall. We won't be able to use that here. I feel like up top here would be a good place for the campsite. So I think I'm not going to put anybody up here. Maybe over here to the side would be good. We could place somebody right here. All right, we're going to place one of the houses right here. We've got plot number two all picked out. My phone is ringing. Er, darling, it's me again. Sorry for the repeated calls. I forgot to tell you something important. You see, you'll need to get a wreath made from flowers. There are plenty, plenty of pretty flowers growing on the cliffs of the island. So toodle up there if you need to. I've already sent you a recipe for a ladder. It's the ideal tool for when you need to scale those cliffs. Anywho, keep up the good work. Hmm? Awesome. So we've got that. Okay, plot two actually needs the iron table that we created. So let's go ahead and place the iron table right here. That way at least we have one of the items. We could probably put a person up here. But why don't we find a spot up here that would be a good spot? Maybe over this way? Yep, I think that's perfect. Let's just put a spot right here. Okay, we have plot number three is done. Now we need to go tell Tom Nook that we are done. Ah, oh, darling. Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. What should I do? Please don't forget, I'm waiting on you to find plots for three homes using the housing kits I gave you. Check the box next to each plot, mark, plot marker, and find out what furniture you'll need for the home. I thought we were supposed to talk to Tom Nook about it, though. Well, anywho, let's go sell the stuff in our pockets. Ooh, look who's in our shop. It is Abel. She's so cute. Okay, I'm thinking we need a few of these items. So let's grab this revolving spice rack. Not very expensive. We're gonna go ahead and buy that. And then we're also gonna buy this tree. Seems like you're interested in the cypress plant. Yes, we are. We'll grab that. And we're also gonna grab that trash can. Now we're gonna go ahead and sell him all our stuff in our pockets and see how much we can make from it. Looks like we can get 10,380 bells for all of that. So we'll go ahead and take that. Let's see if they've got any roses of different colors besides white in here. Oh, we need to get our candy. Let's grab candy. They also have this wetsuit. Let's buy that. That way we can start going into the ocean. I want to also get this melon umbrella. I think that's super cute. Red Cosmos, red roses. Let's grab these red roses. And then we've got white mums. We already have those. Yellow roses. Yay, it's our lucky day. Let's see what DIYs they have now. We have a pitfall seed recipe. We don't have that. Let's find that recipe. Ladder setup kit. Do we have this one? Nope, we don't have that one either. Let's grab that. Test your DIY skills. I feel like we don't have this one. Yes. Yeah, I want that one too. Well, we pretty much just spent almost everything that we made, but that's okay. Let's just check their wallpaper and floor too, see if there's anything we want in the wallpaper and floor section. Ooh, we have this really pretty yellow wallpaper. Let's grab that. I also like this green floral floor, and I also like the green painted floor. And you know, we might want the white subway tiles for our kitchen, so let's just grab it just in case. All right, let's go put some items back in our house. Let's go ahead and put this wallpaper we just bought. Let's put it up on the walls. Which one do we want? The yellow one or the subway? Let's do the yellow one. Well, and that flooring doesn't match, does it? Ooh, that flooring's pretty. What does the subway wall look like? Oh, see, that's kind of a nice kitchen, isn't it? Maybe if we make this main room our kitchen, that would be kind of neat. I kind of like that. But let's put the rest of the stuff up in our storage. We're going to go ahead and wear the wetsuit because we're going to start... Oh, the radiator. Let's put the radiator. Let's see. How about usually? It seems like they're like right under a window. Will it fit under the window? It does not look like it. Let's see if this radiator will let us move it. Nope, it will not fit under the window. So let's just put it like next to the window then. There we go. We got that cypress plant. It's maybe not the color that I want, but it's a start. And the garbage can, we'll go ahead and put that outside. We'll just place the garbage can, like, say, right about here. And we still need to talk to our villager, so let's go in here and talk with her. Let's talk to Phoebe. Interesting. Very interesting, Phoebe. Let's check our nook miles to see what it is we still have to do. But we forgot to check the hot item to see what the hot item was. Sell a hot item and then earn bells. Catch five fish. We need to catch two more bugs and we need to do a stretch. So let's start catching some fish right now. Can we? Yes, we have a fishing rod. We've got one right here. Let's see if we can catch this little guy. We got him. 
We got a horse mackerel. Here's another fish. Let's see if we can get this guy. We got him again. Awesome. We're doing good at this. So far, these are fish that we can sell because we've already caught them before. Let's see if we've got anything over here in the streams. Oh, there's a bug. Let's catch a bug because that's one of the other things we have to do. There's an itty bitty little fish. Let's catch this little guy. Oh, I think we got something new. Yes. We caught a neon tetra. Now let me place that down so I don't forget and accidentally sell it. Oh, and we've got to plant our roses. Darn it. There's two bugs right there that I missed because I went too fast. Let's learn these DIYs that we have here too. What'd we get? Sweet. The pitfall seed. Oh, these are the ones that we bought. That's right. You know, I haven't heard any balloons come by. Looks like there's a fish right there. So let's grab that fish. Ooh, we got trash. We do not need trash, but that is what we got. Got it a butterfly. You know, I kind of want to give some of these butterflies to Flick so he can make us some butterflies. We got more trash. Jeez, today must be trash day. This empty can could be repurposed. I've got an idea. There went our flimsy fishing rod. We're gonna have to go grab another one. I think I might have another one back in the back of the island. I'm hoping. Otherwise, we're gonna get stuck making some more. Let's grab this bug on our way. We'll hold these butterflies for flip. Oh, and there went my net. Oh my goodness, I'm just breaking all kinds of tools. Let's put the butterflies right here so that we know these are for flick. Oh, I do not have any back here. So it looks like I am going to be making some. So why don't we like change things that we're gonna do then? We finally have a balloon. Let's grab the balloon. Let's see what we get. It's a yellow one, so maybe we'll get some money. We did, we got 10,000 bells. Good deal. Oh no, we forgot to catch the wasp on that one. I don't don't think we're going to be able to fix it, but we are going to try. Oh darn, we didn't do it. I thought we had shaken all those trees, but apparently we had not. I think it's time to change our hair. Let's see if we have our hairstyle that we like to wear most of the time. Let's change it up. No, we don't have the hairstyle, but that's okay. We'll just kind of change it and give it... We'll do something else, something besides straight hair. I think I must have gotten the wrong one. We'll do that one for now. Oh, it didn't change. Never mind. We won't change it then. We need to get the correct hairstyle anyway. Let's go ahead and gather up all the things that we've made and see if any of the houses need these items. Since they were new in our inventory, I kind of just assumed that they were probably some of the items that the house is needed, so I made a bunch of them. We are at house number one. Let's see if there's anything that we need. Check exterior items. We need a hay bed, a swing, and a barrow. Let's check the interior items. Apple chair, juicy apple TV, and a pot. I don't, I don't have any of those, but I do have a couple of the outside items. Okay, we've got the swinging bench. We can place that. Uh, let's get it over a little bit so we can place it a little better. Okay, so there's the swing and they also wanted the barrel. All right, so the swing and the barrel, we've got that for that house. We only have two items for that house. That kind of stinks. Let's check out house number three and see what we have for house number three. Check the interior items. A wooden simple bed, wooden chair, and a classic picture. An exterior, log dining table, log bench, and wooden bucket. I think we have all of those. Okay, a log dining table. We have the bucket and a log bench. So we have everything for the exterior for this one. We'll give them a succulent too. Why not? Let's see what part of the interior we actually have. So let's uh, check interior and let's submit some items. So we've got the wooden chair and we've got the wooden bed. Classic picture is the last thing I need, but I do not have enough of the clay in order to make the classic picture, picture. So we might have to wait till tomorrow to be able to make that once we hit all our rocks. So I think we're done for today with plot three. Let's go check out plot two. Okay, plot two, we needed the iron chair. I think we have that. Guessing we need the birdhouse too. So I haven't seen the birdhouse come up yet. I'm gonna place it, just guessing that that's what one of them is, but let's check it. Exterior. Yep, we got them all. So our exterior is done. Check the interior. Wooden block stereo, wooden block table. So we have one item. Well, that's it for those because we just don't have enough today. Ooh, let's get this. Let's get down here. And let's go ahead and gather all the wood that we hit over on this side and see if we can make some more stuff before we end our day. I think we are going to finish today. We got all three of the plots put down. We did not get all the items. We got all the items for one of the plots, but not all of them. So we'll have to work on that tomorrow because we don't have enough supplies for it. But we did get our Nook Mile Plus. I think most of our Nook Mile Plus. I don't know that we got all of them, but I've been playing for a bit on this day. So I think I'm going to take a break, go get something to eat and then move to the next day. So I will see you guys all later. Thank you so much for joining me. Have an awesome day. Bye. Bye.